Betty Fieser Kitchen. All right, 16 minutes now before 9 o'clock, and our favorite food truck chef, Chef Andario, is here. Chef Andario Johnson, who also owns Casos Cuisine, the standalone restaurant, which is doing pretty good now, isn't pretty it? Pretty good, yes, oh, staying busy. You got to do that, and its location is? 3418 Tucker C.G. Road. And it's so easy to get to, plenty of parking out there, and mm -hmm. you can get whatever you're making on the truck at the restaurant, too, can't you? That's right. That's now, right. can... Can we get this, what you're making here this morning? Because it looks so delicious. Oh, yeah, this is my special today. To, to told the special today. Today we're going to make some sweet potato waffles. Sweet potato waffles. See, yeah. now I'm not, <laughs> I don't know that I've had sweet potato waffles before, but it sounds absolutely wonderful. So what are you using here? This is some flour. Uh, this plain self white flour. Plain flour. Self-rising flour. Self-rising flour. Okay, self-rising flour. we got to add and our sweet potatoes. Now, where are these from? Are these out of a can? or did you Oh, get no can. No, oh, no, no, no. Oh, Fresh. Did fresh. you hear that? Everything yes, fresh, fresh. sweet potatoes. <laughs> yeah. uh, I love sweet potatoes. Just boil them and, you know, oh. peel them, boil them. Now, that's interesting how that works that right there. there. Yeah. Then I got some eggs. We're going to add two eggs to this. Two eggs as sort of a binder. Yeah, so we keep it together. together there. Oh, already, this looks good already. I don't care what you're going to make out of this because I'm thinking these are some great things. A little sugar. Oh, a little sugar. All yeah, right. Got a head of sugar. I like the way you aren't measure measuring this. You sort of do it by eye. But this is what a good chef can do. They look at it and yeah. they know. And I'm, I'd be standing here going, now where's my teaspoon or my tablespoon or something like and that? Here I have a little canola oil. Mm -hmm. uh, we've got some nutmeg. Ooh, yeah, nutmeg. Just a little sprinkle of nutmeg there. Okay. Cinnamon. Cinnamon. Got about two minutes here. I want to let you know cool. so we get this. And we I have some we'll get vanilla extract. Vanilla. Oh, wow. Put a little bit of that in there. Put that all together. You want to get your whisk and whisk it all together? So you don't oh, put buttermilk water, or water, anything water, in this. I'm oh, sorry, you're water. The wa you're Almost got the, water the main in ingredient. <laughs> yeah. Now, could you use buttermilk if you want to do that? You can, I, I don't yeah. know that I've heard of buttermilk waffles, per se. Yeah, you can. Yeah, of course. But look at this going to get... And the aroma is wonderful right now. Mm -hmm. Oh, that is just... You just got to whip it all together, break that um, sweet potato down. Yeah, look at that. That's what you call some elbow grease working there. That's your elbow power. I guess you could put you it gotta in the blender. You've got to work that wrist. But I, I think, it's, why do I think it's always better when you do it with by hand? I don't know. I'm just old school. I don't old like school. to use it all like the machines and stuff. So, you know. All right, put a little pan here on there. the griddle. And we're going to put a little bit down here. And, you, yeah. and the, the secret is not so much that it's going to overflow. overflow. Yeah, that should be perfect right there. Oh, yeah, that's looking good. Put it Look all at around this. there. We're going to let that cook. Oh, man. How, about how long do they cook? Does there Take a, about a, three minutes in a good waffle iron. Ah, good. Now, we're not going to have three minutes, of course, in order to be able to show you this coming right off there. But take a look at what you, you get. we got the finished product here. And this is a sweet potato waffle. Mm -hmm. And that just is amazing. Oh, it looks so good, and you too. Gotta you got to top it off with my cream cheese sauce. Yes, That's what I had a this little. sauce is like, you've <laughs> got, I, just give me the bottle. I'll just eat what's in, I'll just eat that sauce in the bottle. And you're doing this on the truck today or just in the restaurant? Um, this is in the restaurant today. This yeah. is in the restaurant. the restaurant. So I would get special. over there. It's on Takasiji Road, too. And you don't want to miss it. All the fresh ingredients and everything. And our food truck is at North Tryon and 6th Street today from 11 to 2 p.m. Oh, there you go. Cousin's Cuisine. You can't do any better, let me tell you what. Andario, thanks so much. We're going to try a bite of this now. We'll be right back.